Okay, so we are on page 43, and tonight we are going to do numbers 7 through 12. Um, last night we talked about how the word and, let's write the word and right here, joins together. And it can join together uh, two sentences, it can join together two subjects, two verbs, um, so we're going to work on that, and we're going to label and as a conjunction, K-O-N-J. All right, so number seven. Craig gave Tom a boat to sail on the lake. The first thing we always do is check our two. Sail is a verb in this case, so we're going to double underline it and put MV above it. Where is he sailing? On the lake. First word's preposition, last word's a noun. Anything in the middle is an adjective. Don't forget your arrow. Who or what is doing the action? So we have Craig and we have Tom. Which one is doing the action? The person doing the action is Craig. Because Craig is the one who gave. Craig is my subject and gave is my main verb. Okay? Number eight. Ellen and Kevin were the winners of the game. I don't see any twos to check, but I do see of, and I know of is a preposition. So of the game is a prepositional phrase. Don't forget your arrow. Who or what is doing the action? So I see Ellen, but then I see the word and, and and joins two things. So it's joining the two subjects, Ellen and Kevin. So we're going to underline Ellen. We're going to underline Kevin. They're both the subject and they were both joined by the conjunction and. Now, what did Ellen and Kevin do? Ellen and Kevin were, that is the past tense form of the word, to be. It's not really an action, but it still is a verb. Number nine, between the trees and the fence, Joan found her ring. So I see the preposition between. And I'm going to squiggle between the tree. But when I see that word and, it tells me that I'm going to keep going to another subject. So it's to another noun, excuse me. So it's between what? It's between the tree and it's between the fence. So I squiggled this long, 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 long prepositional phrase because there's two objects of, of the preposition because of the word and. The first word is a preposition. The last word is a noun, but with the word and, there's going to be another noun, and that noun is tree, because if I say between what, it's between the tree. So I put a noun here. Now the two words before my nouns are certainly adjectives, just like always, and is an adjective. And then the other word that we have in here is and, and we know that and is a conjunction. Whew, that was a long prepositional phrase. Um, so, now I ask myself, who or what is doing the action, and that is Joan, and what is Joan doing? Joan found. Joan is my subject, found is my main verb. Number 10, that dog wants to sit beside Linda and Lisa. So I see a two, I'm going to check my two. Sit is a verb, put a V above it. And my prepositional, um, my preposition is beside, and it says beside what? Linda, beside Lisa. I have a conjunction. So there's two objects of the preposition, or two nouns. Squiggle it just a little bit. And, and is a conjunction. Okay, don't forget that and is a conjunction, not an adjective describing Lisa. Okay. So you are doing numbers 11 and 12 for homework. All right. Have a good night. And if you don't have too much to do, maybe you should do the video for tomorrow night. It's a great way to go ahead and get some work done. Goodbye.